my friends so this is it this is the final of this unit so as you got accustomed every time when we finish a unit we have an evaluation uh, test so today you are going to have an interactive evaluation test because you are going to work together with me so we are going to uh, revise everything that we had during 12 lessons till now so if you are ready, take please a pen, a pencil that you need. You can put the book away, so in this way you have the possibility to check what you have learned during all these lessons. Are you ready? Let's start. The first task is to read the text and do the tasks associated with it. So look please at the screen, I'm going to read and in this way you have the possibility to listen this dialogue. Castle for all seasons. Guide. Now, we have come to the Leeds Castle, one of the most romantic and most ancient castles in the UK. Tourist. What time does it date back to? Guide. In the 9th century, this was the site of a manor of the Saxon royal family. Since then, it has been a Norman stronghold, a royal residence to six of England's medieval queens, a playground and a palace to Henry VIII, and the private home. Oh, it looks great! The setting is breathtaking. The lake, the castle itself, surrounded by a green arc of parkland, thick with trees and hills are just fascinating. Guide. Yes, kings, queens and seasons may change, but Leeds Castle is enchanting and its English beauty is lasting, whatever the time of the year. Tourist, shall we go inside? I've heard that it houses a magnificent collection of medieval furnishings, French and English furniture, paintings, tapestries and treasures. Guide, you sense it. This is a place where visitors of the present meet with the lives of the past. Even the leaves breathe history here. Tourist, whom is the castle being administered by now? Guide. Leeds Castle was saved for the nation when Lady Bay, the last private owner, established the Leeds Castle Foundation on her death in 1974. Tourist, does it receive any grants or government funding? Guide, of course not. The income comes from visitors, conferences, national and international meetings that are essential for the continued conservation of this important heritage site for future generations. Tourist, what is the admission fee? Guide, admission is free. Now let us proceed to the task. So, the first task, find in the text a synonym for the verb to rescue, an adjective meaning enduring, durable, an antonym of the adjective modern, a verb meaning to manage or direct. So take a few minutes and find in the text. Okay, and the second exercise is to form a noun from the adjective magnificent, to form an adjective from the noun change, to form an adverb from the adjective essential and to form a noun from the verb to breathe. So, do these two exercises, take as long time as you need and afterwards, by the way, don't forget to pause and afterwards we'll check your answers. Are you ready? So, let us check. The synonym of the verb to rescue is to save. The adjective meaning enduring durable is lasting. An antonym of the adjective modern is medieval. The verb meaning to manage or direct means to administer. And for the second task, 
Form a noun from the adjective magnificent is magnificence. Form an adjective from the noun change is changeable. Form an adverb from the adjective essential is essentially. And a noun from the verb to breathe is breath. If you did it right, you did a great job. Let us continue. The next task. Task number three. Which words in the dialogue mean the same as a large estate, surroundings or background, a strongly fortified place, to overcome with O, fabric with pictures or designs woven in it, act of attaining to a right, and the next task is to scan the dialogue and answer the questions below. What has the castle been since the time it was built? What collection can be found in the castle nowadays? And whom was the castle saved by and why? So take a few minutes, pause, do this exercise, and afterwards we'll check. Are you ready? Let us check. So, a large estate, it means manor. Surroundings or background, setting. A strongly fortified place, stronghold. To overcome with O, to enchant. Fabric with pictures or designs woven in it is tapestry. Act of attaining to a right is to own. And the answers of the questions are what has the castle been since the time it was built? And if we go back to the text, we can find that it was a manor uh, of the Saxon royal family, and also it was a Norman stronghold, a royal residence, uh, a playground, and a um, palace, and of course a private home. Good. The next, what collections can be found in the castle nowadays? So, in uh, this castle we can find a lot of collection of fern, uh, furnitures, yes? So, according to the dialogue, uh, here we can find a lot of medieval furnishings, French and English furniture, paintings, tapestries, and treasures. Good. Whom was the castle saved by and why? The castle was saved by Lady Bale because she was the last owner of this castle. We continue with vocabulary and grammar exercises and the task is to match the words in pairs of synonyms. Please pause this video, work with these words and uh, pair them uh, as synonyms and afterwards we'll check. So, are you ready? Let us check. Small, tiny, to offer, to propose, wealth, treasure, inheritance, heritage, pick, top, to unite, to combine, to bring up, to raise, to stress, to emphasize, flat, plain, ditch, trench, impressive, touching, person, individual, dry, arid, pattern, modal, different, diverse, abrupt, steep. Congratulations if you did correctly. If you didn't, you can practice more. Let us continue. The next exercise. Use the correct form of the verb in parenthesis. So, please do it. Pause this video, work alone, and then we'll check the answers. So, are you ready? Let us check. Norwich is a beautiful and ancient city. From St. James Hill, above the city on Mousehold Heath, the buildings of old Norwich can be seen clustered around the cathedral. The streets and alleys, the churches and the fine old buildings illustrate how prosperous and important Norwich was for nearly a thousand years. The next task is the same. Uh, use the correct form of the verb in parentheses. So pause, 
work alone and then we will check the answers. Are you ready? Good, let us check. Nelson was a pupil at the school here, first established in the 15th century. Opposite the cathedral is Tombland Alley, where many victims of the Great Plague were buried. Just around the corner is the restored medieval street of Elm Hill, lit at night by the warm glow of lamplight. Good, good job, let us continue. The task is the same, use the verbs in the correct form. Pause this video, work alone, and then we will check answers. So, are you ready? Let us check. Theatre Royal, first established in 1757, still presents productions of opera, ballet, and theatre. Over 100 years ago, the writer George Borrow said that Norwich was a fine old city that is still true today for citizens and visitors alike. Great job! Let us continue. Let us play a little bit articles, yes? You, we know a lot about articles, good. So insert the correct articles in these sentences. You do the same. You pause, you work alone, and then we check answers. Are you ready? Okay, good. Let's check. Saint Etienne was already an old building when it became the Cathedral of Paris in the 10th century. B. Great Gothic churches were springing up in the north of the country. C. In 1163, Bishop Maurice de Sully laid the first stone of the new cathedral, Notre Dame de Paris. Great job! We continue with inserting articles. Okay, so do it again. Pause this video if you need. Work alone and then we will check answers. Good. Are you ready to check your answers? Very good. Let us check. 1. In this room there is an exhibition recounting the history of a building's construction and restoration works. 2. Here, there is a breathtaking view over the Seine and its bridges which give Notre Dame a rare charm of being the cathedral of the water's edge. 3. A complete tour of the top of the tower provides a bird's eye view of Paris in every direction. Great job! Let us continue. The last point of today's evaluation test is the writing point. So the task is write a paragraph, 80 words, commenting on the quotation. One touch of nature makes the whole world kin. William Shakespeare. Here we finish our meetings and this is the last time when we have the possibility to be together uh, in the virtual world. Thank you very much for your attention. It was great working with you. My name is Galena Orbu and for me it was a pleasure and an honor to be your teacher for this entire unit. Good luck and see you. Bye-bye.